Um, do you guys uh, want to talk about Grohl for a sec? Yeah, let's Grohl it out. Yeah. So Dave Grohl got in the news today. Today. Just a couple hours ago yeah. for having a child out of wedlock. The Notes app apology. The Notes app apology for Unreal. cheating on totally your wife. Totally crazy. Out of left field. Yeah. Never would have seen it coming. I did not have that on my bingo card. No, I would have never thought this. He is like rock and he's rock and roll Jesus. Yeah, through and through, yeah. making people barbecue that are in like underprivileged communities. Has gone through multiple deaths in his life of bandmates that are tragic. Yeah, very successful, very unanimously well liked, and uh, has a wife and family, like three kids, and uh, cheats on his wife and has a baby. With someone else. I mean, wild. Th- there's part of me that can easily believe it. <laughs> there's mean, part of me that sympathizes. I did not I'm sympathizes, kidding. but I mean, we, uh, there's still enormously famous people yeah. with anything that they could ever want to get. Yeah. I guess. You know, like we wouldn't, if we heard that this happened in 1984, we would have been like, nothing. blink of an eye. Yeah. You know, like, I guess I'm his... sure the guys from Motley Crue are like, yeah. I've done that before, brother. <laughs> That's what you do. <laughs> That's what you do. <laughs> yeah. I guess I just thought that, like, and a lot of people probably, with his personality type and who he is, I thought that he was fucking immune to any wrongdoing ever. Yeah, I think a lot you know? of people think that, but I feel like it's just, you know, it kind of, it's the basis for the show. That's like the you know don't meet your heroes. You know, yeah. yeah. Like, like everyone kind of thought Mulaney was this good, this goody two shoes, funny like yeah for the you know the Tumblr high school girl type of vibe. Yeah, um, has you know cute little jokes, and then he's a fucking maniac drug addict who cheated <laughs> yeah. on his wife, had a baby with Olivia Munn. Yeah, and it's all like holy shit, this guy's a fucking monster. Yeah, and it's like. Grohl's, we don't know that about him, but, like, no one should be surprised if that came out about him. Yeah, like, we, we shouldn't be surprised about literally anyone. Anybody. Yeah. Yeah. It's and anybody. Like, I wouldn't go as far as going Millennia Monster. Well, not a monster. <laughs> I know you mean. I know Maniac. You mean. He was, I mean, the shit he says, it's like, dude, you are a psycho. <laughs> yeah. Wow. No, I agree. I mean, yeah, it's it's very, like, I agree that it's shocking just because of the public persona of... Dave Grohl. Yeah. You know, but I think that you kind of have to be like half the shit that we learn about anybody famous is just total bullshit. Yeah. Yeah. You know, especially if you're the size of Dave Grohl, it's there's a PR machine at work that's going to be telling you that they're this type of person, blah, blah, blah. And that image is, um, you know, profitable. It's good to have that image. Mm. Like you're not going to have the same profitability. Be like, I'm actually a good dad, good husband. Every once in a while, I get a little something on the side just for me. You know, nobody wants that. Just nobody while wants... I'm on tour. It's on tour, so it doesn't count. Different yeah. area code. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, it's definitely not behavior that I, like, condone. I think it's pretty lame to do that yeah. if you have a family, but yeah. it's also not the biggest rock star on earth cheats on his wife. Is like... Yeah. Yeah, water's yeah. wet. Whatever. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, yeah. I, I get I get what you're saying. I like like I said, I was just still floored cuz I feel like yeah, it's... he was the most his image the shit he put out there even with Foo Fighters who writes like some heavier rock and he screams whatever, the most wholesome fucking guy yeah. ever, yeah. you know, by definition and Eight-year-olds coming up to play all the instruments. Yeah. 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 Like this 9-year-old knows the bass line <laughs> ever long. Yeah. Do, 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 yeah right. You know. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's just it's just a, a funny thing. It was like, don't meet your heroes. Like, don't think that any guy that you look up to is someone worth looking up to. Whoever your you, your hero is is probably someone behind the scenes that you'd be like, this all this is fucking like insane what you're doing while you're on tour. Um, yeah, it's, and I think it's like. You know, you look up to things that they do. You know, like if you like Dave Grohl, yeah. like like his songs. Right. Yeah. You know, exactly. He's a really good yeah. drummer. Right. Exactly. You know? Not yeah. like you don't want to be like. I mean, you know, he's got a, a book and he's got documentaries. He seems like a great guy. My yeah. favorite drummer is John Bonham. Do I want to be the person John Bonham is? No. Exactly. No. Yeah. And it just a goes horrible to show human being. that and Jack. Dave... Okay. Oh, so I was just gonna say Jack White is just taking that. Dude. That victory lap he's, around all of these guys that yeah. he came up with. He was, he was like trailing in the rock power charts for years, <laughs> and then he was just like, you boom! He's just like, fuck all you guys. Dave Grohl, you're in the fucking news for cheating on your wife. Josh Homme, you're about to die. Yeah. Uh, 
please say, don't say so. I mean, it's not looking I'll, great though. It's, I mean, who he's, knows his what's health going is on? Yeah, but his true. health it does not look good. Um, Black Keys. You're oh, fucking yeah. canceling your tours. Yeah. While Jack White is making pedals at like a 50-year-old age and putting out like some of the best music he's put out in a while. It has nothing to do with it. It's just funny. Yeah, yeah. it is. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and it's like I, I, I also don't think that this makes like everything that Dave Grohl ever did or said like a sham. No. No, no, I, no, no. You know, just he, he has, fucked up. He yeah, fucked he has up. flaws. He fucked up. And it is just so ridiculous that we live in the time that we live yeah. where it's just at An any Instagram point post. you're on social media and then you look oh Dave Grohl just put out a <laughs> notes <laughs> apology that he knocked up an IHOP waitress <laughs> and he's trying to you know fix it with his family you're like what hey, what, do, what just why happened? do I know this yeah why yeah. is this like the way that we're sharing yeah. things like that should probably be kept under wraps only with yeah it should come out like 10 years later it should be in the second in like book. his memoir yeah, yeah exactly yeah, and everyone's like wow is that true I but, but the problem is that ihop waitress got it on her phone too yeah and she could just like, like oh we got a beat or two yeah. <laughs> boom yeah it was funny because we looked at his instagram and like he posts a lot of like notes app things like quotes oh i guess so it looked like just Another one post. of the others, yeah. <laughs> it, like fits in with the aesthetic of. Oh, let's pro. see what Grohl's brain <laughs> droppings <laughs> are today. <laughs> it's just like, oh like, no! Whoa, wow! I think we all know that Dave Grohl will be learning to walk again. <laughs> let's go to a break. I'm learning to fly. Oh, that's Tom Petty. Learning oh. to walk. Again. What's the What's the learning? I got to... another confession to make. I got a kid. <laughs> there goes my hero. Yeah. How does Learn to Fly go now? I can't think. Uh, oh, I'm looking, looking for the guy to save, save me. me. Yeah. yeah. Looking for a no tap apology. <laughs> yeah. Hope this comes out right. <laughs> Hope my PR team can find <laughs> the right word. I can't think. Uh, um, yeah. yeah, and that's like something too I, I often think of like when I see the no tap apology. Like, is, you know, is it like him just be like, oh, what do I say? Or is no. it just like he's like, I, I got a studio session in Burbank. Yeah. Someone get me. something good for me, all right? <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah. I got about 1230. I want you to send something yeah. over. I'll give it the up or down. I got to go like, do blow with Jack Black. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Someone get something good up for winning. me. Winning. Uh, <laughs> winning. Yeah. Um, yeah. So that's the news for the week. Yeah. yeah. 